Welcome back to The Road Show. This morning in the buzz brought to you by The Comedy Connection. There are positive phrases that we all know that are supposed to boost your mood, but <laughs> these phrases can also just be plain annoying. Oh, I love this. In a recent survey, 79% of people <laughs> believe saying such phrases can improve their moods. It really doesn't. It doesn't happen. For example, uh, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Thank you, Kelly Clarkson. Uh, was ranked as the top positive phrase. Oh, that's the top one. Okay, whereas 41% of people believe live, laugh, love should be banished. I agree. <laughs> also, other sayings such as it is what it is, happiness is a choice, mm -hmm. and good vibes only. Okay, other annoying phrases include YOLO. <laughs> uh, that slaps. This Barbie, <laughs> this Barbie is blank. Sheesh. And beverage goblin, which I've never heard before. Never heard of. Megan asked me this morning. This is what it is. Beverage goblin refers to someone who needs three drinks at all times: one for hydration, one for energy, and just one for fun. Oh God, yeah, You're a beverage goblin. You can't, I can't do that anymore. No, no beverage goblin here. Is there anything that really bothers you? Look, when people start posting, you know what drives <laughs> me crazy? When people start posting the the, the positive sayings yeah. on like Facebook. Like if you got to go on social media and some some somebody's yeah, on there and they posted there. like you know one of these positive messages. Yeah. And I'm just like, look, I, I get it. Nobody cares. I know. It's not going to change your day. But you, like I, I was saying to Brendan this morning when we were doing this, every single one of those things on the list, right. I say. Oh, you do? So I was like, mm -hmm. is this an intervention oh, that God, you guys no. just this really is, want me to? All of a sudden, this became, I do. All of a sudden, this became very awkward. <laughs> <laughs> well, you were like the people that share positive Well, yeah, no, it's true. Like, it's true. Oh God, yeah, yeah. I just follow me like I can't, Instagram? like I can't. I just, I, I see some of these people, and it's you know, it's either like some. Well, the really people positive. that share them, I have to say, are normally the most negative oh, they people are. I have ever met in my well, life. You've come to and the right place. I know, negativity. and you know that they don't mean this, but they're posting right, it anyway. Right, right, right. Right? Because they want to seem like you know, all like positive. Yeah, Svengali, right. you know, <laughs> you know what I mean. And it's just not. Like they all want to seem like they're kind of like in the know. You know they're not. Right. Stop the nonsense. Uh, but I just say it is what it is all the time. Right. I mean, if my kids were here, they would look at that list and be like, check, check, right. check, check. I text them positive things. Right. Do they send you guys this buzz topic today? No. Okay. No. Now, one of the things I say all the time, and I, I'm telling you, this one, this one is a real one. What? Forget about all the other garbage this year. I say life is too short. Yeah. Right? It's true. We're we good with one? We're good with that one. All right, one. Brendan, are we good with life is too short? It's positive, yeah, it, not negative. It's perfect. I'm not trying to preach. <laughs> Preach away. Lay your hands. <laughs> no, I, I mean, like, I'm not. I'm not trying to preach. It just is. Life is very short. I'm ready to pass the collection plate. Yeah. Well, <laughs> hang on. Get the, get the cup. I'm get the Dunkin' Donuts cup. Donuts cup. <laughs> no, I mean, it, whatever whatever helps get people through the day, I understand. But sometimes it's like, all right, enough with the sayings. Right. You know, let's just come on. And Audrey's right. It's usually from the most miserable people. Yeah. <laughs> it really usually is. Right. Eat, pray. No, wait, what? Oh, eat, eat, pray, it's, love. I keep getting eat, pray, love confused with live, laugh, love. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Eat, both are equally as bad. One's a horrible movie. Right, yeah. right. <laughs> anyway, uh, whatever gets you through, but sometimes oh, it's. Oh, that's the one. That's what this is. Yeah, what do we do? Oh, that's another one. Hey, right. right. whatever gets you through. <laughs> Speaking of which, the people, they are what get us through right here this morning on the road show. I've fired up, been away. Nathan's up first. He says that a previous job, a co worker would overuse no worries. Now, that. when it is said to me, I get doubly worried for the original <laughs> issue and for the person saying it. <laughs> so I like funny. that. Denise shares a classic she's sick of. You know, it's not rocket science. Well, no, yeah, that's, that's a popular true. one overused. James adds, I cringe when I hear the phrase, live in the dream. Oh, oh, oh yeah. So, how you doing? Oh, live in the dream. No, you're not. You're living a nightmare. We all are. <laughs> when asked how that person is doing. <laughs> that's the attitude. <laughs> Oh, I like it. And I love Rhonda's comment closing it out. Have a blessed day, gang. <laughs> I like that, Rhonda. Very nice. Thanks for chiming in, everyone. And please keep those comments coming. Uh, follow us at The Road Show, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can follow us. I really, you know, I'd like to be a Price is Right model. I think I'd be great at it. Over to you, Drew. <laughs> <laughs> Still to come this morning on The Road Show, we're speaking with the producers and co-writers of Good Burger 2. They're filming shot right here in Rhode Island. How cool is this? You are watching the Roadshow and